The Paris Observatory French, Observatoire de Paris or Observatoire de Paris Meurdon, a research institution of PSL Research University, is the foremost astronomical observatory of France, and one of the largest astronomical centres in the world. Its historic building is to be found on the left bank of the Seine in central Paris, but most of the staff work on a satellite campus in Meurdon, a suburb southwest of Paris. Topic: Constitution. Administratively, it is a grand établissement of the French Ministry of National Education, with a status close to that of a public university. Its missions include research in astronomy and astrophysics, education, four graduate programs, PhD studies, diffusion of knowledge to the public. It maintains a solar observatory at Meurdon, 48 degrees 48 minutes 18.32 seconds north, 2 degrees 13 minutes 51.61 seconds east, and a radio astronomy observatory at Nanke. It was also the home to the International Time Bureau until its dissolution in 1987. The Paris Observatory Library, which was founded in 1785, provides the researchers with documentation and preserves the ancient books, archives, and heritage collections of the institution. Many collections are available on the Paris Observatory Digital Library. Topic: History Its foundation lies in the ambitions of Jean-Baptiste Colbert to extend France's maritime power and international trade in the 17th century. Louis XIV promoted its construction, which was started in 1667 and completed in 1671. It thus predates by a few years the Royal Greenwich Observatory in England, which was founded in 1675. The architect of the Paris Observatory was Claude Perrault whose brother, Charles, was secretary to Colbert and superintendent of public works. Optical instruments were supplied by Giuseppe Campani. The buildings were extended in 1730, 1810, 1834, 1850, and 1951. The last extension incorporates the spectacular meridian room designed by Jean Prouve. The world's first national almanac, The Connaissance des Temps, was published by the observatory in 1679, using eclipses in Jupiter's satellites to aid seafarers in establishing longitude. In 1863, the observatory published the first modern weather maps. In 1882, a 33 cm in astrographic lens was constructed, an instrument that catalyzed what proved to be the over ambitious International Carte du Ciel project. In November 1913, the Paris Observatory, using the Eiffel Tower as an antenna, exchanged sustained wireless radio signals with the United States Naval Observatory to determine the exact difference of longitude between the two institutions. Topic. Heritage The Paris Observatory Library preserves a great number of original works and letters of the observatory and well-known astronomers. The entire collection, archives, instruments, iconography, has been inventoried on Alidade. Some of the work is now digitized on the digital library such as Havelius, Lalande or Delisle letters. Among other, are to be found Administrative documents Scientific observations Scient IFC work of Giovanni Domenico Cassini Scientific work of Jacques Cassini Scientific work of Charles Messier Annual reports from 1878 to 1940 Numerous images of instruments, buildings and persons Murdon 83 cm Great Refractor The Murdon Great Refractor Murdon 83 cm was a 83 cm 33 in aperture refractor, which with September 20, 1909 observations by E. M. Antoniadi helped disprove the Mars Canals theory. It was a double telescope completed in 1891, with secondary having 62 cm 24 in aperture lens for photography. It was one of the largest active telescopes in Europe. 
Topic: Directors. The title of director of the observatory was officially given for the first time to César François Cassini de Thierry by a royal brevet dated November 12, 1771. However, the important role played by his grandfather and father in this institution during its first century actually gives them somewhat the role of director. Topic: <laughs> Facilities. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Paris. Topic Merdon Solar Observatory Tower Merdon Chateau de Merdon LESIA Space and Astrophysics Instrumentation Research Laboratory Topic Nanke Nanke Radio Telescope Topic Saint Verin, also known as the Observatoire du Pic de Château Renard, the Observatoire de Saint Verin was built in 1974 on top of the Pic de Château Renard, 2,900 meters or 9,500 feet, on the commune of Saint Verin in the Oqueras, Hauts Alpes département. A coronagraph was in operation there for ten years. The dome was moved there from the Perrault building of the Observatoire de Paris. Nowadays, the Astroqueras Amateur Astronomy Association operates the facility, using a 60 cm 24 in telescope on loan from the Observatoire de Haute Provence. Numerous asteroids have been discovered there. 